gonna shoot at 300 meters at an electronic target over there. But I found some really hilarious commercials for Norma ammunition. So, airgun pellets, 22 long rifle, 6.5. And look at this old timey rifle with a diopter. It's hilarious. And uh, one of the more fun ones was behind that door over there. It's, it's super fun. <laughs> so have you tried Norma Field Torpedo with a new Tombak bullet? No! What's good about that? It's the bullet! It's super fast! Tombak has less barrel wear, etc. Is it possible? Yes. <laughs> I'm guessing this is from the 1970s or something. Like two distinguished gentlemen talking about the 6.5, new 6.5 round by Norma. The field torpedo, Tombak projectile. Try the Norma field torpedo with Tombak as well, uh, you as well. Look at this old man. You cannot not trust him, because he has the field torpedoes. It's awesome. And here's how you learn how to shoot. Standing. That's wrong. That's wrong. It's a lot of wrong ways to do it. <laughs> so yeah, that's hilarious. I'm going to try to shoot my a bit more modern rifle. My AR. Oh, this one might not be as modern though. It's from the 1960s. So I'm going to guess this rifle is older than... Than the commercial commercials, <laughs> but uh, that's still going strong. The state AUG, but yeah, that's that's the 1960s model, the A1, the first one with the donut of death reticule and all that good stuff, and the 20 inch barrel with a bayonet lug and all that good stuff. Probably the first civilian version of it as well. Not sure when, when it actually was made, but it's pretty early. But yeah, that's a very modified German ER 50. Ah, so it's already started shooting. So yeah, they're putting up the targets. Let's see if I can zoom in. Yeah, yeah those, those black dots. I'm going to try to hit in the middle of them. We'll see how, how well that'll go. Okay, yeah, wish me luck. Always one flyer. Vi kan ju sätta en i och köra och så blir det garanterat. Om Alina och Oskar har Hilda. Eller låna vagnen och gå en promenad. Det brukar ju också funda. Ja. Oskar, hejdå.
men jag tycker det, det är inte riktigt värt att... Alltså, den här, den här är inte riktigt rätt. Eh. Så det går att skruva, men det är ganska mycket glapp i den. Okay. Nu får man dra sönder skruvan. Nej, det är skit i det. Eh, vi ska. Pretty hard to hit. Hi guys. So I went to the range with a friend, did some pew pewing, and a new shooter was there. I didn't film him because I didn't want to. Um, anyway, he's been shooting for a year. He had an AR and he had mounted uh, an LPVO too far back. <laughs> he had some problem actually getting a, a stable shooting position and he couldn't get the bullets to land on the target where he aimed. So I told him, if you want to mount your scope, just lay prone with a good shooting rest, get comfortable while, while having your eyes closed, and then just have the scope like finger tight on, on your rifle, if even that. And then uh, just open your eyes when you're comfortable in a comfortable shooting position, and then see. Can I see the picture clearly and have maximum magnification as well? If you can't, move the, the scope forwards or backwards. Because when you have maximum magnification, the eye box shrinks. And if you can see clearly through it in a good shooting position, <coughs> uh, then it's going to work at a lower magnification as well. So when I tried it, I, I had to have, have the, uh, the stock at the furthest out position and also put, a, put my hand behind the stock and the rifle uh, and my shoulder as well because it was so far back. And uh, yeah, so I, to I, I told him this and taught him how to get a stable shooting position. He, he, he got to borrow my, my rifle to do that and my, my rear bag, told him how to aim with squeezing the rear bag and, and like having a very loose right hand and basically just trigger finger is the only thing moving and how to squeeze, 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 fill the shelf in the two-stage trigger and then take the shot between breaths and all that good stuff. And then he got a really good group, like a very small group at uh, 300 meters. So proper technique and actually mounting your shit correctly on your rifle is <laughs> does wonders. It wasn't a bad shot. It was a really good shot. He just didn't know the details of, of how to do, how to accomplish the, the mission. <laughs> Putting a little piece of lead or several pieces of lead where you want them in a small grouping. Yeah, so that was interesting. Uh, otherwise, I had a good day. Uh, you guys have a nice day. See ya. Hello to mama. What is the story, guys?